Welcome to the Talk of Life Talk Show with Alma, with my host, Cynthia. Hello. Kimberly. <laughs> and our guest host, Tavana, tonight. Yeah. Woo! All right, all right, all right. We're going to introduce our guests right after my scripture, which is Philippians 1 and 6, and I'm going to freestyle it. Whatever God <laughs> started in you, you will finish. And that is such an awesome yes. scripture because yes. whatever he started, and he started such a great thing work. in both yes, of you all, a great and work. he wants you all to finish it. Yes. Okay? And my motivational saying is, I forgot it. <laughs> you have to finish it. <laughs> you have to finish it. Yes, yes, yes. That was a good one, wasn't it, Yes, it was. <laughs> it's like, well, what is it? I just <laughs> love having fun. I love talking. And uh, my three little models in the back, y'all, they can really model. Oh, they good at modeling. Okay, and I'm trying to get this one in that magazine quick. Stand up here with that one. This is what I'm trying to put in the magazine right here, y'all. That's the other one that's going to the Navy. We salute to Mama. She's going to the Navy. All right, all right, all right. Okay, tonight for our special guest, we always want, I, I mean, I was just excited when I found out about you all on Facebook. And one of the things we love to do on the show is for those that may not know you, we want them to get to know you. So I'm excited to meet Carbet, Carbet and Sanford tonight. Give it up for them. Yes. And they own C&S Laundry. That's right, right? CNS Laundry. And they are black owned. Yeah. They are all for 1001 Woodhaven Boulevard, Suite B, and the great city of Fort Worth, Texas, known as Cowtown, USA. Yes. yes. I've never met a black owned laundry uh, mat person. So you yeah. all are our first guest yes. on the show, right, yes. Kimberly? Yes. So we're excited to have you all on the show. Thank you, for uh, that. because you never hear of uh black owned laundromats. I've never have you ever heard of one, Kimberly? No, just as Cynthia. No, just Me Asian. either. So maybe we, because we, we had neither. Oh, y'all have neither? <laughs> yeah. Maybe because we all have washers and dryers and you don't go to the laundromat like we used to it back in right. the day. Correct. Uh, but now it's good to have them because a lot of people can't afford washers and dryers because they are so expensive. Yes, they are. Gosh, they're expensive. You know, you're talking about in the thousands of dollars yeah. for a washing machine and a, a dryer. Uh -huh. yeah. They're not a $50 anymore. Gosh, you right. Yeah, that, yeah. That's, that's scary. Yeah. They're that expensive. <laughs> so tonight we're going to uh, just find out a little bit about you. I, I uh, met you through Mr. Hogan. And I met him over at another meeting. We always meet. He loved taking pictures. And I was looking at Facebook. And I said, there go Mr. Hogan again on here. <laughs> and he was over there talking. Uh, I think it was just you, Carbet. And, uh, and he said that... Uh, this uh, uh, lady here owns this black owned laundromat and my mind went ding, 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 ding. We got to get him on the show. And I inboxed him and he sent me your number and I text her and she said she would love to awesome. be on the show. Awesome. And she said, I can't come by myself. I'm going to bring Sanford with us. So we're happy to have you, Sanford. I almost said Sanford and son, son. but uh, you know. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> yeah, you know, I almost said that, but you know, but anyway. Okay, so I was looking on Facebook and it said that you all are self-service, laundromat, high efficiency, washers and dryer. That means they ain't good and they are, they look nice. They are. I saw They're a branded. picture of them. They really look nice. Thank Make you. me want to go over there and get in them. Oh, but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> large washers and dryers for washing comforters. Yeah. Very clean. Yes. Uh, flat screen TVs and what is that? Air conditioner, what is that? Oh, that's in the laundromat. Uh -huh. I was thinking they wash flat screen TVs. Yes! <laughs> that won't work, y'all. They don't wash uh, flat screen. But it is. They have flat screen TV. They have air conditioning so you can just sit there and watch the Talk of Life talk show with Elm and wash your clothes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes, that sounds good. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So, okay, so tell us how you all got started. What, what, yes. what, uh, yes. What brought this into existence? How, how did you all get? What make black people want to have a laundromat? I know. I, I thought the same thing. And I, <laughs> I will tell you, I've always I've been self-employed as well mm -hmm. um, for a while. Okay. But never wanted to. I never thought about the laundromat industry. Wow. My first 
uh, introduction to the laundromat industry was when we wanted to partner for something. Um, we were high school classmates. Oh, what, what oh, high school? Uh, Trimble Tech. All right, Trimble, Trimble, Trimble Tech, Tech in the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see the green shirt? I see the green shirt. Yes. Yeah, I love that. And it has C and S laundry on it too, y'all. That was uh, Trimble Tech colors. Uh huh. Oh, okay. All right. I'm from a country town. I was blue and white. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so you all decided to. We decided to. Um, well, he was looking at um, wanting to go into something, uh, mm. invest into something, do some type business. And so That's once good. we actually got involved in the looking at what, at first it was properties and somehow he stumbled upon a laundromat and I'm like, I know nothing about a laundromat. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. And wow. we ended up going into it and we had to figure it out as we went. <laughs> but let me ask you something now. Is the laundromat, okay, it's off of, I know it's off of Woodhaven. Now, is that where uh, Bennigan, it used to be a, a Bennigan's, I think, there. That's, um, that is, that is another Bridge place? Street. That's another place. Okay, that's another if place. If you know so where the Potter's House is yes, in Fort Worth, right. okay. mm -hmm. it's on the same street, the opposite side, just a block down. Oh, okay. Because so I was trying to figure out where we're, it We're in the corner. You have to find us. Okay. But okay. it's worth finding. Okay. <laughs> it's worth finding, you all. So go, you can go to church over at the Potter's House, go wash your clothes. Just come wash your clothes. Yeah, just come yeah, okay. wash your clothes and go back to church and come back and get them. Yeah, that's same side <laughs> of the Potter's house. It's on the opposite side. Oh, yeah, go under the underpan. Uh huh. You gotta, well, no, um, you gotta go under and go back. It's um on the same side, uh -huh. but you oh, would go um north on, north north okay, okay. on Woodhaven. Okay. And it's right next door to the fire department. Okay, okay. that should be easy. Y'all hear that? Uh -huh. <laughs> but on the, on the same street, but the opposite side. Okay. We're gonna find <laughs> it because I'm coming by there it. to check y'all yeah, out. You have to. You have to. I'm gonna sales. come by there because I was looking at. <laughs> so you all decided to come over to lunch. Was it already a laundromat? It was. It was a laundromat before zombie we laundromat. got there. And it, was, it was what the industry calls a zombie laundromat, which What's means that uh, it's a laundromat uh -huh. with poor conditions in it. Oh, okay. The it was dead. Like... dead. Oh, there okay. was no excitement about it. They didn't bring any excitement about it. So uh, we we were, we were I ran across this guy uh -huh. and I spoke to Corbett about it. And uh -huh. uh, we just kept meeting with the prior owner. Uh, and then he was in the selling it. So we was like, hey, listen, we're interested. This is a, a market that black people like us never tapped into. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's and we good. wanted to make sure that uh, we take this to another level, I guess you That's would say awesome. it was. So we, we were interested and, and we said, like she said, we didn't know anything <laughs> about it. We just said, let's let's leave it in God's hands and keep going. I was going to ask you that. Did y'all talk to God about, we prayed about it? Oh, yeah. That's good. Pray. Acknowledge oh, yeah. him in all nine nothing, ways. Nothing. And now y'all got the laundromat. <laughs> you know what I thought about. Have y'all seen that uh, show on TV? I think it's a Tyler Perry show with um, uh, the pain that the, the woman paid. Uh -huh. You know, they had a laundromat on one oh, of those I didn't shows. Know that. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I thought, I don't know if y'all have y'all seen that one yet. Yeah. It, it you was, saw that did one? you see it, Tamana? Mm hmm. You know, they uh they they uh started a laundromat and similar to what you mm -hmm. said it was a day so it's a uh series that they was a, I don't know if it's still on TV, but I thought about that when you said it was a zombie and I'm thinking zombie are they dead people over there or what? <laughs> you know. Yeah. <laughs> but that is so good. So uh you all went in and remodeled it and all this good stuff, right? Did it take a lot to remodel? Yes, it did. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. oh, yes. It was really messed up. Oh, yes. The, oh, the, wow. The thing is, is that we're in a, um, a community that yeah. I grew up in. I grew up in Poly. Okay. So okay. we're in a community like that. Oh, and okay. just because you're in a lower income community mm -hmm. doesn't mean that you, your facilities have to be a low thank income you. facility. facility yeah. So our goal that. was to... Just the way we like. I mean, yeah. I wanted the, the same laundromat I wanted to go, go want to go into. Yes. I want you to be able to go into. And enjoy. Right. It. right. Exactly. Right. Make the washing nice, the clothes. It's clean. It's yes. fresh. It's safe. You know, everything is. Um, that's that, the same thing I would want. That's what we wanted to present it to the community we were coming in. Right. That and is so awesome. that's that's where that started. Wow. <laughs> now, how long you all been in business? It'll, it will be three years in October. Oh, one for the father. So, and then it's in a good month, my birthday month, October. So I know it's going to continue to be blessed. Okay. So um, 
Do y'all have people working for you or you all run it yourselves? I know you said self-service, but you do you have somebody there. You, you want to tell about the start to now? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I want to hear about this laundry mat. Yeah, so okay. We started out, okay, self-service means that yeah. you're able to come in yourself and wash it yourself. Right. However, we do offer a service of wash and fold as well. Yes, I saw that. We do that service and we also uh, pick up and deliver. So, so you will come to my service. house and pick up my dirty laundry Correct. if you want? Really? Yeah, oh. we'll pick them up, bring it back, oh. wash it, fold it, take it back to you. Get well, out of here. Just put it in your drawer. Yeah. That's it. You just put it in your drawer. Or hang it in Are your Are you closet. serious? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Damn. So it's, it's, a, it's now, a, that is yeah. interesting, isn't it? There are not a lot of uh, laundromats that offer that for our area, our people. You're right. None of that stuff. So we want wow. to cater to that. Now, as for employees, yes, we, we started out. <laughs> uh, it We're was two. rough. It was rough. Okay. Seven days a week. Seven days a week. Okay. For the first year and a half. For the first year and a half, uh-huh. I would get off and work and and she would get off and I'll go in. So we would like doing that for a year and a half. Uh wow. until we just said, Hey, listen, we gotta hire somebody because we're burning out. You okay, because you all was working on your regular job. Uh, so yeah. it was closed during the daytime? No. No. Uh uh-uh. uh. It was open seven days it's, a week. Wow. Uh-uh. Yeah. So we did both. So wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. It was it was it's, it's hustling. Baby. I know. It's hustling. I'm gonna say, like yeah, you know what I'm saying? You can't say flow. This hustling flow. Right. Hustling flow. That's hustling flow. Yeah, so that's hustling we, flow. y'all had to hustling be working right day and night or what? Yeah, I would take the day shift. Okay, he would take the evening. Yeah. Okay, then you would work in the daytime, and then you would go to your other job. In yeah, evening. because Ooh. I have a tax office, and so I'm flexible. Okay. Um, on that. Like mm-hmm. I just do my stuff and it's virtual. My stuff is virtual. Okay. So I would move everything to wow. so it's day and night working, okay. basically. Yeah. You know, and so that was what 60, mm. 70 hours for Ooh, y'all a long should have been burnt. Ah. Well, and it's but it's what you have to do when you yeah. start right. to get we, up. We knew we couldn't go into this thinking that the laundromat was gonna pay our bills. That's true. We understood yeah, that. That's true. And we understood that you had to build Yes, yes. Right. Loved it up. to get yeah. it to a point where yes. you could say, okay, now I'm ready to, I can afford to hire someone. Right. Right. That's awesome. And, and that's where we are today, where yeah. we have, we actually have uh, four employees in, outside of that's ourselves. Good. I love it. I love right. it. So three years yes. later, yeah, uh-huh. we're actually, and we're looking, we're actually, we're hiring one more person and we're looking for another. Okay. Mm-hmm. But we're um, finally where we can say, okay. You can take a breather. Now. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Uh-huh. Yeah, so you go to work day. during the daytime. Yes, ma'am. Are you still working your daytime job now? No, uh, it has afforded me to leave that and focus on the laundry. And oh, work. thank God. Now, that is a blessing. Yeah. Now, that's a blessing when you can have a business and you see the profit coming in where you both can just enjoy. Mm-hmm. But it takes hard work to be of any business. Exactly. And a lot of people don't want to go through the hard work. They no, just want to come right in them. and make the money or they mismanage the money and then they end up going bankrupt. That's right. And that's why I think um, our partnership worked because we had that same mindset. Mm. If we had the mindset of, yes. oh, we're going to take all this money and we mm-hmm. got to pay, like, I'm going to go do this. Yeah, go buy me a lim- we, what you we call that part, the lemon jean bean, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> lemon bean, I like that, I like that. Uh-huh. I like the way you put them together. I like that, I like that. Go give me one of those. I'm going to ride back and let all these people know, hey, I got a laundromat. Look yeah, what the I'm coins, look, the and coins next week, and we're it's closed. Six months. <laughs> I, give months. Yeah. I give you six months. I give you six months. Look, you go to the uh, yeah. Bentley dealership no. with all your coins. You know, yeah. The Bentley dealership. Why have a lot that's me why I'm cold. That is all right. We roll them. You can take them. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> that is That's awesome. Neat. This is awesome. So you all put together this, this business. And I love the way you say, do you have a lot of pickup and deliveries though? We have a lot of pickup and deliveries. Uh, we have commercial and residential. So we're, uh-huh. we're what? tapping into both markets. So, That's good. Yeah. Wow. We're looking to continue to expand, you know, so we're just one day at a time. So is it only in the Fort Worth area that y'all pick up or? Uh, yes, actually. Right now. Our current, our largest uh, contract is with, uh, I don't know if you guys heard about the decontamination, uh-huh. uh, where they, the uh, PPE uh-huh. products that you wear your face mask and yeah. they try to clean all that stuff. Uh-huh. We have a contract with those guys, which they look, they found us. Thank God yes. they found us and they wanted our services. So. 
Wow. Uh, we've That's been awesome. we've been rocking together for a pretty now, long as far while. as Very laundry. Blessed. Oh, go ahead. Uh huh. What'd you say? No, go ahead. No, as far as laundry mats, so you are the only laundry mat. Now, I know cleaners may do that, but I mean, as far as a laundry mat, you're the only laundry mat that um, folds and delivers. There are other laundromats that do wash and fold. Mm -hmm. There are, um, I mean, and take to the house, like cleaner mm -hmm. places that do pick up and delivery, like mm -hmm. for your napkins. Mm -hmm. But there aren't any laundromats that actually do pick up and delivery. That's awesome. and that's wash neat. And for, for your garment. That's uh -huh. really yeah. and, and we are the only black-owned laundromat. In that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yes. That's why I'm so excited because y'all on yes. the show. And then you yes. offer something that other laundry mats Correct. do not offer. And it seems to be five star. And that's what a lot of people are looking for is five star quality exactly. service. And, and the main the main thing with us is customer service. Customer yeah. service. And I can tell y'all both have good customer service. Because uh -huh. yeah. to fold it up very, and take very it very into important. their home and put it in their drawer, they have to trust you. Yes. Yeah, of really. course. Of course. Wow. Not to walk out with things and things of that nature. Exactly. Awesome. You know, is it to put your trust in us to allow us to take her take your garments yes. away and bring it back safely. It's you know, and hang them it, in the closets. Yeah. You hang go in up, someone's yeah. closet. Y'all like, do no, all that too. We they, just drop it off at the door. Oh, you drop yeah. it off, but it's, it's, ready, it's for. ready for them. They it's don't ready put it in there. Exactly. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, yeah. Because I was gonna say, shoot, you best to scare them. I'm not yet. Wiggy, y'all, who you got? We meet you at your door. That's come fix my closet, please. Now that's an awesome service, y'all. Yeah, man, come on in. But that is good. That's awesome. Let me ask you this: Do you um? That's awesome. A class for folding? How do you uh, determine how class. it? Is? Yeah, I'm the class. <laughs> now, did you learn professional folding? Is a technique like they do in the stores? No, I have OCD. That's so okay. That's, that's good. I'm, I'm very particular about how things, about neatness and yeah. proper way and all that stuff like that. So I tend to, uh, yeah. So I went and purchased this. That's what I often ask you. Did you have that little thing that goes? Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I bought that. Uh, I saw that on TV. That's me yeah, why I asked. We, we tell all our employees well, to use it. Yeah, that, that you is know, so neat. Use this because it's it's consistent. Yes. It's very consistent. It, it, and very it folds neat. it real good, yeah, it though. It neat, yeah. Everything looks nice. Everything right. looks so yeah. nice. Because I, I started to order me one of them. Because you just put your shirt in there, bloop, 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 and it's, yeah, and it's, it's folded it up. Yeah, it works. It's really nice. It really works. Now, really do y'all, okay, do you say, um, now, do y'all iron too? Or you don't do that part, huh? Okay. You always have someone. That's what I would. We we are not a dry cleaner. We're a right. coin-operated laundry, but we do have a customer okay. that we take care of with his. Uh, he travels a lot. Okay. Okay. And That's so good. he wants his uh, mainly everything go hangers mm -hmm. and a uh, few shirts, collared shirts that we have to iron. And yes. I take it upon my, you know, yes. we we do that. Yes. He actually built a folding table in the back. Where we could do the ironing and stuff. Okay. Wow, good. that's ooh, that's creative. Because you have to have someone on the team. Like mm -hmm. it, we can't do everything. That's so right. one has to be good at this. One yes. has to be good at that. That's what makes the business. So yeah, it balances. But yeah, that so we do for him because we know he what travels. He does yeah. different things. So we we I actually do that for him. But it's that's not a, a normal You're not service be that we offer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. Okay, now they only doing that for that one person, you all. So unless y'all want to pay them a very good fee, yes, and he, he pays extra. Yeah, he, okay? pay, he, he pays extra. <laughs> you pay, he pays extra. So if y'all want to pay extra yes. and you busy. Hey, uh, Corvette might uh, iron for you, okay? Right, right. But you got to pay extra for that, okay? So what's the, so what's the future hold for you guys since you're doing so well with this? Is this something is something awesome. that you want to build and have more laundromats or? Franchise it out. Yeah. Well, um, we hadn't told the other service. We have other services there as well. Okay. okay. For instance, okay. we um, also sell daiquiris. Oh, we have our DNG license where we sell daiquiris there. Not at the laundromat. At the laundromat. Oh, yes, y'all. Come to it. Let me give y'all oh, that address yeah. again. Yeah. She said, she <laughs> turned uh, into a chill uh, spot. We advertise that too. Yes, yeah, she can. Okay. <laughs> so in this laundromat, you can sit back and get a daiquiri. <laughs> And the address again is 1001 <laughs> Woodhaven Boulevard, Suite B, Fort Worth, Texas, C and S 
laundry. You can get a daiquiri in your glass. Are they burnt? Oh. Right. They got some. They got a little some we something have, in them. Yes, oh, the daiquiris. Oh man, they got light washing yes. clothes now, baby. Yeah. Where the clothes at? Where the clothes at? Whoa! <laughs> man, I don't know awesome. where the my laundry. Yeah. Laundry is a pleasure. It's not. Yes. A chore. Oh my god. Laundry, <laughs> we make laundry fun. I, do you have to? It's yes. Not like yes. <laughs> so we can come in. Now we got this flat, uh, big flat screen, TV, air conditioning, music, <laughs> music, music. music. <laughs> and then some daiquiri. What about just daiquiri margaritas? Is that? Just well, uh, sometimes we'll have was daiquiris, margaritas. We Cinco de Mayo we ran I saw margaritas that. a lot. Yeah, we I had margaritas that. a lot. They okay, like, y'all. So look, just imagine. You're mm -hmm. sitting mm -hmm. there with your, y'all put your glasses up, <laughs> with your glasses, and you have some daiquiri in there, and your clothes are being washed, and you're watching football or the yeah. Talk of Life talk, talk show, life, talk and life. you're what, drinking? Mm, you forgot what load you're on. Oh, yeah. you done forgot all about the loads, honey. You done forgot all about the drive and all of that. I'm finished already. Like, See, that's what I'm saying. You be like, dang, I got to start another one, you know? So this is awesome. That's what I'm going to tell my husband. <laughs> I'm, tell my husband. <laughs> I'm going to wash the comforter. Where you going, Fort Worth? Yeah. Wash the <laughs> Why you got to go to Fort Worth to wash the you, you don't even understand. <laughs> no, no, we are going to the laundromat, and he gonna say, "But wait a minute, Kim. You got all my stilettos and everything. Like, I got my stilettos and everything on. Yeah, where your clothes at? Though? You got to have a basket or something. <laughs> no, I'm going to get the daiquiri. Oh no, no, no. You know they're not gonna believe that. They are not gonna believe that. They're not gonna so believe nice. that. that the daiquiris really nice. are also to go as well. You can come in, purchase, and take them to go. As you well. can drink them inside or like take that. them to go. Either one. That's yeah, still fun. Ooh. That is so nice. Y'all about to that's really like hey, we go. <laughs> oh my cool. God! I've never heard of this before. I know. It is the first. Uh, I know. That is so nice. And they're black all with daiquiris in a laundromat. <laughs> and a TV and some. Jazz. My mom will be said, "Babe, you know you're not going to no laundromat." <laughs> and then you go get up and preach on Sunday, drunk. <laughs> <laughs> Now you can't be going out on no Saturday night to no laundry. Just come see us on Friday. It's okay. It's on Friday. One day we're coming. One day we're coming. Okay, girls. We hey, uh, uh, producer Emmanuel. We're gonna have to take this show to the laundry. To mat. the laundry mat. Yeah. Yeah. Can we do that? Absolutely. Can we bring the show to your laundry mat? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. you yeah. all, we're going to bring the Talk of Life talk yes. show with Elma. To CNS laundromat. Yes. And you all gonna, we're gonna tell y'all where we gonna we're gonna book appointments so y'all can bring all these people that wanna show up on the show. That's right. And we're gonna have a party at the CNS we're laundromat. Gonna be washing and, clothes. And washing clothes. <laughs> washing clothes. And we're gonna have our big screen TV. We are going to have an awesome oh, time so nice. there. Again, it's 1001 Woodhaven Boulevard, Sweet Pea. I want you all to, you know, meet us over there when we have this. And please go out. And take, it's even if you don't want to wash, just go by there and get you a daiquiri. Yes. And yeah. just sit there and watch, right? Can we and do that? you can be you cute, You don't even have to wash your clothes, Yes, Kim. you can be cute. Sit there, you don't even have to wash your clothes, no. baby. You okay. Just and yeah. matter of fact, you know, yeah. when we come, we're going to have them to style for y'all. We're going to have them to style. We're going to make this a big thing. Huh? We're going to make this a big show that night when we come. We're going to have a show fashion down. show. We're going to let Kim and Cynthia come. Because Devon will probably be in the Navy on the she wall. But I'm serious. Y'all think I'm playing. But you know, you don't play with me like that. Cause I will. We're going to make this happen, right? We're going to make it happen, right? Okay, so seeing this, we coming up. Y'all should have never told Very Kim about no that. Because she might come by there tonight. <laughs> so what are your hours? We are open um, Monday through Friday, okay. 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay. Oh, and on Saturdays good. and Sundays, we're open 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. That's okay. nice. Seven days a week. And we sell. On oh, Sundays, what time? 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay, that's Sunday nice. and Saturday is the same time. Uh -huh. Okay, then okay Monday that's through. good. So, Friday. Uh -huh. So, you, okay, so y'all have a break now because you have employees, right? Yes. Okay, uh -huh. so y'all don't have to be out there. Do y'all ever? Well, we're still in? there. I'm just gonna no, say no, no, yeah. no. So okay, hold on. Still, okay. We're still on the schedule. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're still employees at the laundromat. Oh. So okay. if we have four employees, okay. well, we're employees as well. Okay. Okay. So wow. we we're on the schedule. 
weekly. Yeah. Okay, so you yeah. are on the schedule with your other two employees. Other four employees. Four employees. Uh-huh. Oh, so, so it's six, six of you all. Uh-huh. Oh, that's even uh-huh. better. It's growing already. Y'all look like that sauce that moving on up. <laughs> all right, I like that. We haven't moved up enough to get out of it. So <laughs> we still have to work. We but ready for y'all to, to put another one in Arlington and Dallas and mm-hmm. wherever else. Mm-hmm. We going to prophesy Lord tonight that y'all going to be all over. Amen. Because think about this, yes. though. Amen. How many uh, black owned that we can start you all over in Arlington and Dallas and Fort Worth? I mean, uh, what's another? Grand Prairie. 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 You know, I'm talking about for uh, laundromats and blacks. So oh yeah, that's I, black laundromats. Yeah, no, that's not, with daquiries and with music. With daquiries and all that. See, that's and the, you that's said the thing. you said you had other services. Did we what, miss that it? Was, that, that was that was, a, that's that was the best good. one right there. Uh, Shoot, mm-hmm. the daquiry get you there. <laughs> okay, get you there. The doctor is going to get them there. After a hard day of work. Yes. yes. And then have to take your clothes? Yeah. Then you can go home to the kids. That's right. <laughs> yeah, that's your mother's, hey, that's that's the mother's day out. Yes. Yes, yes that's fun. mother's y'all day out. Y'all making it fun. <laughs> they are really making it fun. Okay, so you have on here. I, I went on Facebook and got some of you all stuff, okay? Okay, y'all. Let's, we go do a review. They do wash and fold service. They will pick up your service for you. Now, that's the part. I like that part, too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now, I, I like really that. I like that I part. Like that. I signed the deck is number one. But mm-hmm. I like And you can <laughs> schedule it. Uh, we have a website, and you can schedule that online. For I saw that. That's true. Oh, that's that. nice. Yeah, for whatever day you want yes. it picked up, we can, do. day and time. You just schedule it, and that is, and it is on the website because I went through that website, and you actually, I did, <laughs> you did I went research. through, it. I researched it, girl. <laughs> I got on that website and I saw, and what really caught my attention, I love the pictures that you all, you know, the way you have your, the laundry, the the machines and everything uh-huh. lined up. But I didn't see the DAC report. I must have been looking too much. But uh, I like the way you have your pictures on there and everything. And it looks so nice. Thank you. It really you. looks clean. You know, the last uh, laundromat when I, who it's been years, uh, when I first moved to Fort Worth, um, when I went in, it was just n- nasty. That's you know? why we call it zombie laundromat. Yeah, that's yeah. what you call it. Zombie. Okay, it was it wasn't clean. Uh, they had, you know, stuff all over. Uh-huh. And have y'all been to one of those before? Yes. Mm-hmm. You know where you walk in there and they got the odor and all that stuff, and you'd be I'm like, trash. oh god. And the restrooms are nasty. nasty. Y'all yeah. restrooms are clean, right? They're oh, beautiful. Yeah. Oh, gosh, tell really me about nice. the restrooms. Well, our restrooms are really nice. It's like you, it looks like a restroom like you have at your home. Oh, good. It's not it's like nice. your typical gas station laundromat good. that you, I mean, gas station restroom that you walk into. Okay. So it, it, we do have a nice restroom. I love restrooms. When uh-huh. I go yeah, into restaurants, I go into the restrooms. Oh, I want to see how the restrooms yes. look. Uh-huh. It yes. Doesn't it? I tell you, if those restrooms, you'd be like, do I really want to eat here? Yeah. You know? Yeah, the restroom is kind of like your your front yard if you go to a house and the front yard is brown kind of know what the inside of the yeah. house is like <laughs> so yeah you can the definitely grass make is that dead dead. And grass dead is dead on the inside <laughs> that is awesome okay so you they got you have their washing fold services that means y'all are wash them fold them and they're ready to put in the drawer Correct. yes that is awesome and you can bring them in okay or we'll pick them up Okay. And you have on here uh, drop off your clothes of different colors, size, materials, and pick it up clean and neatly fold. Hang within four hours on the same day. Same day. Are you serious? That depends on. There's there's a little bit of okay space for that that. because it depends on what time you bring it in. Okay, good. So if you come in at eight p.m., you won't get that back to the next next day. day. Yes. So, but if I drop it off at uh, what time you say you You drop it off at six? Okay, you can pick it up by ten. Yeah. Okay. 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 So, so I can pick it up any time between whatever, but like you said, if you go to eight, that's now, on the weekend. I wouldn't expect that nowhere. At eight but it's it's within it it's within those four hours. Yeah. So okay. if we're open during those hours, okay. you know, like if you bring it at six, you can pick it up by ten. But of course, you bring it at eight, four hours, you're gonna have to pick it up the next morning. Right. Okay. So the time Monday through Friday is what time again? Uh, eight a.m. to ten p.m. Okay, it's eight a.m. to ten p.m. Monday through Friday at seven. 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay, 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Saturday, Sunday. I'm telling you all this because I want y'all to schedule your lunch breaks there. (laughs) 
Your dinner there. Yeah, come see us. Yeah, come and see. Come, see, come, see, come and see who? CNS. I uh, want you all to schedule that. Y'all need y'all gonna open up a little restaurant in there too. <laughs> it, we, it, we, that been was about. <laughs> we been approached by everything. I'm serious, because yeah, y'all might yeah. need have you know you get to drink. I don't drink now, but but what I did used to drink. You know, you get hungry. Y'all gotta have some of the hors d'oeuvres or something that we can, uh, you know. We have vending machines. Yeah. Okay, y'all, okay, that's <laughs> good. Yeah. Hey, a vending yeah, machine, dude, that'll work. Yeah. What's in the vending machine? <laughs> you can get everything. We have laundry supplies and okay. vending machines. Okay, that's good. So, y'all snacks, uh, okay. sodas, but everything is a one stop shop. When you walk inside a laundry, okay. man, you don't have to leave back out. Ooh, uh, all a lot right. of people, they're, oh, my, my, Forgot my washing pad or my yes. laundry detergent or anything. No, everything is in internal. Wow. So once you walk in, you do not have to leave back out. They probably don't want to leave, but after they get a couple of daggers, you probably have to call that Uber or something. Turn <laughs> like time to go. So as far as when you wash for your customers, um, that service, what about sensitive detergents and things of that nature? That you, well. you, they have to just let you know. Uh-huh. Yeah, they we put we asked them all sorts of questions. Uh, okay. Uh, what okay. type of detergent do you would you like bleach on your clothes on your wife? Oh, that's you, good. Uh, do you have any sensitive skin? So we have a, a list of items that they would check off Gosh, when they're asking those awesome. questions. Okay, of course. People you. like you say with sensitive yeah. skin. Yes. Get, you don't want anybody to break out and break out right, right. right. That we don't awesome. want bad Google reviews because right. they Google. They yeah. do give reviews. <laughs> okay. True. Yeah, so, we have yeah. customers that come from West Side, uh, from the South Side, from way over here to Woodhaven. So we got customers coming all that's from all good. around. Yeah. So Ooh, that's good awesome. reviews. The Facebook page is just for the the cleaners. Is it page for the cleaners? Uh, oh, no. The laundry. I mean, I'm sorry, the laundromat. On Facebook, it actually has it under CNS Laundry and Daiquiris. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. Uh-huh. So it has, it's actually labeled CNS Laundry and Daiquiri's. Okay, I got to look that up. Because I only looked up under the C. Now, I, I, that, CNS like, yeah. Laundry website yeah. is straight. It's just straight okay. the laundromat. Mm-hmm. That's how I missed the daiquiri. And I think it's it, it's on there, but it's not very prominent. Yeah, because like, I didn't see it. Like, that's not the focus. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're mainly <clears throat> trying to um, uh, let you know that we do have pickup and delivery. And that is. Fold and and they have a little truck on there. You all with the little pickup yeah. and delivery. <laughs> and it's so cute. Y'all need to watch, look at their website. And uh, they do, uh, again, they do the wash and fold service. They will pick up your clothes. Let me ask you this. <clears throat> do anybody, when y'all pick up the clothes, do they have the underwear in there? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, they what have are you a little. Say? They have a little everything in there. <laughs> uh, yeah, they have all their garments. And and you, <laughs> you have to understand this day and time. Uh-huh. A lot of people don't have time. That's right. They don't have the luxury of let me come. A, a lot of the apartment or even condos yes. don't have washers and dryers. That's right. They don't. Right. They'll have small facilities mm-hmm. in their in home their complex. Yes. Or kind of, and half the time they're not working, or they're not safe. Right? Are they not clean either? That's right. And so they don't want, they don't usually use that stuff. And Uh so a lot of people, especially like in the downtown area, they want to drop their stuff off and just pick it up. I drop it off before work. By the time I get off, my stuff is ready. And so it's just like going to the cleaners. Mm -hmm. Only you're bringing your all of your clothes Mm -hmm. uh, in, and you don't have to bother with that. Like you don't understand the time saving. Especially it for is. mothers with children. A working yeah. period. Yes. And you don't have the time. Yes. You know, we have mm-hmm. mothers that work two jobs and, and they have, just drop you know, off. three, four children. They drop off because they don't have, they're busy when they get off work. You're cooking them something to eat. That's right. You don't have time for those little things. So it's not just for like um, what you think, you would think executives use that. Mm-hmm. No, it's not for that. Yes. It's a lot of us just don't have the time, time. to do it. Mm-hmm. And so that's why we provide that service. And that is awesome. Because I know if I had kids now, I would probably be dropping them off. Because you want I dropped them off with Yeah, drop the kids off. <laughs> <laughs> Stay here we're with gonna the drop, clothes. We're going to drop yeah. the kids off. Y'all wash the clothes. Y'all wash the clothes. <laughs> wash the clothes. We'll put them in the washing yeah. yeah. <laughs> Watch them while you're washing the clothes, too. Because <laughs> yes. y'all machines are big enough to do all this stuff. Yep. Yes, I really saw nice. them. I'm and you have to them. understand, too, like your comforters. Yes, I was Usually, washing. your washers aren't big enough to wash your... Right. right. Yeah, mine, that's mine is. A nice, thick, fluffy comforter. 
you should not put that in your little you dryer right, washer hard. at home. It's right. Hard, Whether hard, I don't care what they say, the little yeah, it needs to be like a commercial washer. Where yes. it's it does. Not, I all so bunched agree. Up, it's gonna get clean. The dryer, right. it needs a big enough dryer to, because mm -hmm. it will burn holes in your your counter if it's not enough. You know when you're trying to yes. do it at home. Yes. Yes. So it's not just for people that don't have washing dryers. Usually, mm -hmm. even people with washing dryers. Dryer come see us because they can't do those things there mm -hmm. at home. Now, I like the green you have here. What is that like uh, that paint? That the paint, the green Who is that by? That uh, Home Depot. It oh, was, that's uh, pretty. Which is uh, in the safety? Bear. Uh -huh. Oh, I love bear. I told my husband to get bear paint. <laughs> what are you looking at the pop. website now? Mm -hmm. well, I just popped on their Facebook page and I saw the, um, the green. Yes, you can see the they green on the, the back wall. Yeah, I, tell, I told you they got a nice website. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, the gray, and that's gray. Yes. Like that gray. Mm -hmm. That green. <laughs> she green that green popping in. Yes, yeah, popping. It is. The daiquiri and the popping. I'm yes. The background a little bit. She told us a little bit about her background. What's yeah. your background? Uh, so I started out in the mortgage industry. Uh, oh, really? I started out in the mortgage industry. Wow. I've uh, been doing mortgage uh, business for almost 20 years. Uh, then uh, it had always came to me that I wanted to invest in something. I wanted to do some investments, uh, even with friends. I just, you know, I just wanted to do something outside of working all the time. Yeah. Uh, so uh, we met, we, we talked about it, uh, and it was, it was like, let's do something. So we jumped into it, and we just started working real hard on this laundromat. So... Uh, yeah, I'm I'm pretty basic. I don't. I've been. I grew up here in Fort Worth, uh, and it's uh, it was like stay home, do what you're supposed to do, uh, support your community, and and do as much as you can in the community. So uh, we're community driven people, and they are strong careers. They are. Yeah. And I saw where you all was at. Uh, let me see. I got it on here too. <laughs> it was. Uh, did I drop it? It was on uh, the apartment. Oh, here it is. You, I saw you all on Facebook at the Trades Palm apartment, uh -huh. Uh -huh. and they was uh, doing a community uh, barbecue, what, barbecue uh -huh. and they was talking about hot dogs and all this stuff, and I was getting hungry just listening to it <laughs> and everything. So y'all went out to these apartments. Did, did mm -hmm. you know people in the apartments, or you just? Um, we we uh, made it a point to uh, visit all the apartments in the area. And it's a just lot as of a, uh, mm -hmm. yes, it is. Um, a as a courtesy, of. just to let them know yes, that we're that's here. Good. Uh, not to uh, some of them do have washings and dryers, right. and well, in their you know the little yes. washrooms. Yes. But just to let them know that we have other things that we offer the community, uh -huh. um, other than okay, it isn't just about coming to our laundromat. Right. Uh, we have different things that we do in the community that we want you to know about. Mm -hmm. So that's that was our purpose in like getting to know the other apartments. The, the apartments in the community, but we also know certain ones that lack in certain things. And okay. so we try to fill that gap uh, wow. there. Okay, this is another thing I found out on the website. I know. I what is like. this free foods and books on Tuesday? I thought that was really nice. Free food and books on Tuesday. Do y'all still doing that or? Yes, ma'am. Okay, tell, tell, tell us about the free food yeah. and books on Tuesday. <laughs> okay, so uh, Carbet came up with this great idea to get the kids in the community fed while they're out for oh. summer and summer. Oh, wow. So, and mm -hmm. once uh, we kicked that off, it, it it turned out very, very well. Then she said, you know what, I want to implement books into the same equation to awesome. get the kids books as well as feed them during the summertime. So every year for the last <laughs> for the last three, this is our third year for, uh -huh. for doing it, of uh, getting kids fed during the summertime while they're out. They just okay. come to us, uh, which we we want to thank our partners, uh, Eddie Jr.'s Barbecue and Catering. Okay. They were the ones that stepped in huge really? and just catered all the food. Really? Uh -huh. Yeah, they catered Are all they the food. Too? They're black on the Oh, I well. need to get their information. Yeah. Okay, I need They're to get the them on the show then. We need Absolutely. to get them on the yeah. show. Are we talking about peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? No. Sandwiches. No, no, no. Hot, hot food. Lunch. Hot lunch. Hot, they get a hot lunch uh, every Tuesday. I told you I got hungry. Ain't nothing wrong with no peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. No, you're yeah. talking about don't be putting down no peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. <laughs> no, then yeah. the black home, but baby. We do it up. Yeah. We like to eat. Let 
get a peanut butter and jelly. We get some cholesterol. We get that cholesterol. We get Wonder Bread and you put that peanut butter up I got hungry looking at that. I forgot about the books. I'm looking at the food. I said, y'all on Tuesday, I'm going over wherever. Yeah, it's been several times. I went up there and said, wait a minute. Let me take this with me over here and eat this. <laughs> now, y'all do this at the laundromat, right? Uh-huh. That's what I thought it was at the laundromat. Uh-huh. So, y'all still doing it now? When y'all going to stop it? Uh, I mean, we, we'll not stop it until okay. they go back to school. Okay, so. Uh, normally, they would have been right before Labor Day. But yeah. this year, they've extended the season. So, right. whenever they say the kids go back to school, that's when we stop it. Because so okay. I think Fort Worth go back on September, I think. Uh-huh. Though. In yeah. September. Yeah, after they go Labor Day, though. Yes, it's it's September. September. Yeah, I think it's after. the 7th or something uh-huh. like that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, I know those kids go miss that. Okay, Do so. Y'all have a good, okay, go ahead. Do y'all have a good crowd? Yes, ma'am. Okay, yes, what was your question, Kimberly? Well, I'm 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 uh looking at these here daquiris and y'all got little worm gummy bears on the daquiris. top. Y'all got little gummy worms on the top. <laughs> you want to make it look pretty. That's oh, you got some of them with you. I like some gummy worms. <laughs> and then they got right here where you get three different colors. Little we, have, we have four flavors. Look at oh, that. Yeah. Look at I didn't see this. Ooh, I'm thirsty. Y'all Ooh, didn't bring no samples. Beautiful. We should have. Y'all you know what? what? Sample, you didn't bring no samples. Uh, <laughs> look, man, you gotta make sure you get this website oh, that looks good looks like with the black that is so cute mm. and that's that the, nice. the to go that you put it in uh we have uh styrofoam containers and we have oh uh, like wow have, you can get all the way up to a gallon yeah uh, and we have the most reasonable price take that time okay. and that's included on our machines yes. as well as our daiquiris like we're yes. not trying to um break you <laughs> yeah <laughs> That we just want you to have, yeah. We just want you to feel good while you're there Wash your clothes. And you know what, Christians, there's nothing wrong with drinking except when you get drunk and get out of hand. Yeah. Okay. So don't get all <laughs> old holy and down and say, I can't drink because I'm a Christian. No. You just don't get drunk and acting stupid because they're not gonna have that at the laundry right? We got a nephew. We got a nephew too. That's right. All right. Yeah. We got security. <laughs> now I can bring security over there. Yeah. Okay. But no. Go Sam, ahead. Kimber. Y'all got this one uh joke up here when when uh what? when the washer stops, remove all your clothes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was his post. What was that wash with the washer? <laughs> It's that when the wash and stop remove our clothes. I can't show the picture right now. It might not show up on the camera. But I like that one. I like that one. I like that. that remove our clothes. That means she can put her clothes on right then and there. Yeah. I don't want Carlos to see that picture. He might get excited about that one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is so good. So you all have, this is the good part too. You all have somebody there. At all times. At all times. And that's awesome. Yes. Because I walked in some laundromat where nobody was there or you didn't mm-hmm. see the people. That's spooky. Yeah, it is. Scary. It really because is. what if you wash your mm-hmm. clothes by yourself and you never know who's coming in and who's going out? Right. You know, mm-hmm. you could come and get robbed, raped, or whatever in the laundromat because nobody is there. Right. So no that is awesome. it. Mm-hmm. What about change? Um, change. Now, as you know, we're in a change shortage. Oh, yeah. I, know. I wonder why, though. Uh, I thought everybody was giving change. Well, I, I you know what? I, I have my own uh, yeah. philosophies on that. But, you know, with COVID and everything, yeah. I think they're not that producing touchy. as much as they were. Mm-hmm. Okay. And so um, our challenge now is to go coinless because we are totally coin. But but the, the next challenge for us is to be coinless where you just use your car, use your phone, yes. just use that. Okay. That's that's be that's good. the next goal. Okay. But that's a that's a goal. Like that's it takes Well, we're gonna prophesy <laughs> right. that to happen. Yes, yes. We want that to happen. <laughs> and I think that'll be safer too. Yes. Uh-huh. And stuff, you know, because mm-hmm. they can bring their card in and all that. Mm-hmm. That that would be neat. Mm-hmm. But y'all still have the coin yes. thing yes. now. Uh-huh. So you would have to change all the wash machines to Oh. Uh-huh. To, to, to the car where mm-hmm. the slide. Yes. Uh-huh. Oh, that would be neat. Yep. Well, they're so saying that the is reason the why that the shortage is because no one's working. Okay. So being that no one's working, working no nobody. one's out getting income. Yeah, and so, nobody's spending. And, and the like, Federal Reserve is not making it yeah. because of it not being. And I'm and I uh, now I'm trying to do more change since they're saying it. You know, I'm trying to get exact. If it's five dollars fifty cent, I'm trying to make sure I give them five dollars fifty cent, uh-huh. you know, like that. So y'all have That's y'all so have nice a money you. changer, you know, there where yes. you put your dollar in uh-huh. and do that. That takes up to twenty dollars. Okay. And um, you just put your money in there and you get quarters back. Yeah. Okay. Uh-huh. Now that yellow is that safety yellow? What color is that in the bathroom? 
Uh, <laughs> she done went to the bathroom. Uh, now. Okay. Yeah, she got all oh, of that. Oh, I, I see. I didn't see all of this, Kimberly. It's not a little stall. <laughs> this is big. That, yeah, it's so we can take a mattress and sleep in this. <laughs> well, I, I would say the yellow. Uh, that I is need to upgrade beautiful. the picture. It's not yellow anymore. You know, but it's still what, what color are you yeah. changing to now? It's, it's kind of, of a light gray. Oh, but the bathroom is nice. And the bathroom yes. is nice. Yeah. That the is, and it looks nice. nice. Like you can that. eat in there. Yes. We keep it clean. That's good. I can <laughs> tell me a dad uh-huh. on the toilet. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're, we're, we're working there. I mean, we have to use the restroom too. I mean, yeah. so you're going to make it convenient. And that oh, is yeah. so important that's very that nice. you treat your business like, hey, this is me. What I, You know, I tell them in my workshop if you want to know if the person will hire you, look at yourself and say, if you was a company, would you hire yourself? Right. Yeah. And they said, well, that's I'm a gift. I say, no, be honest. Would you actually hire yourself? And they'd be like, well, I guess I could critique this and this, you know, but that is awesome. Mm, I'm just beautiful. excited that you all, I was looking at the Facebook that day and, and saw this and I said, gosh, and Miss Hogan said, here's that number. So I have to give Mr. Hogan, Madison Hogan. A, thank you so uh, uh, much. Thank you. Thank That's you. all to you, Mr. Amen. Hogan, for giving me their phone yes. number. Yes. And I contacted you and friends. you were so nice and was so excited mm, about being on the absolutely. show because I have never met uh, a black owned laundromat because I mm-hmm. never would have dreamed of somebody owning oh, yeah. a laundromat, laundromat and being so successful with mm-hmm. it. And I, I, I'm just gonna, Thank I'm you. just gonna just speak it that y'all are gonna open up more. Yes. I'm going to trust and believe that it's going to go next. Oh, thank you, G. I'm getting chills now. I feel that it. we're going. I, I'm, I'm really feeling it. I'm, I'm praying over that. Thank you. That thank you, you so all much. go oh, higher go and higher world. and higher yes. because God has no limits. Right. So true. if you want to go higher, you just say, "No, I'm going higher and I'm going higher with you all." Go. We're going to do a show. What y'all think? Can we do a show? At that? Can we do a show, Emmanuel? There. All right. So we're going to do a show. Because my son loved to get out. He was saying that the other day that we need to we can go to these companies. And I said, you know, we need to do that. That's a great idea. He said that. He said, idea. Mom, I used to he went to school for all of this. And he said, Mom, I used to do that. I said, Well, why don't we start back doing yes. it? And taking the show out into the community right. and everything. Because when God gives us a vision, I'm crazy enough to act on. Right, exactly. right. You know, I'm, I'm really crazy yeah. enough to act on. Yeah. And when you have people that work with you together and want the show to, you know. Uh, work and, and, and Kimberly is one that uh, uh, goes out. I mean, she just be like, "Come on the show, come on the show, come on the show," and I be like, "Kimberly, come on, go, girl, I got this person." And and, and I mean, we we are doing so awesome because uh, we're having shows now. We got one coming on at eight o'clock uh, where we're uh, taping. And getting people out there. And we get good results back from uh-huh. the show. Yeah, we're so good. we're going to start coming into the community yes. and bringing the show to you all. And this is going to be one of our, we're coming to CNS. Oh, yeah. Yes, yes. we got to come to CNS. <laughs> yes. And we're going to have a party when we get there. That's oh, right. It's gonna be a party. Oh, we're going to have a party. We're going to have a good time there. And uh, we're going to, we want we want all businesses. And I, want, I really want to give it the person that you just said about the catering. Okay. Because I've never heard of them. What's and the I, name of it again? Uh, Eddie Jr.'s Catering. I've never heard of And they're, they're, they're in the same shopping center. Um, they're in the same shopping center as us. Are they the ones that do us. the event planning? I think you have somebody next to you where they do weddings. That's not the same uh, place. Uh, kind of. Mm. Not really. Yeah, That's not, not the same really. place. Uh-huh. No. They're, they're actually, they had a restaurant there. And they okay. open sometimes on the weekend. Okay. But their main business is straight catering. Okay. Awesome. And so That's every awesome. now and again, they'll open. Um, and they also, if you know people that. They lease out their space. Okay. Good. Oh, they lease uh, out well. the space, but that's uh-huh. the one where they lease out the space for oh, weddings. Okay. Uh-huh. But they're there for us, and they cater, you know, all week. But they're there. They made the sacrifice, and they're there for us on Tuesdays. That's awesome. Um, to feed the kids, they oh, prepare it at wow. their end. Yeah, and so we have the books at our end, and they have that food, food awesome. over there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're going to make this a big thing. Because, see, my son owns a photo booth, too. So if y'all want to have an event or know somebody, he does. We, oh, we, he, absolutely. He built, this. God gave him the vision to build his own photo booth, and it's awesome. The Kirk the booth. Is the Kirk booth. It's called www. 
www.dkirkbooth.com. <laughs> uh, it prints the pictures out right there. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh, also, you can text it. Uh-huh. So, you know, hey, we do it all. Oh, Eight by good. tens, we can do it all. Uh, and our okay. pictures come out right then. Uh-huh. We do weddings and everything. So, you know, hey, we're going to hook it up at CNS Laundry. We're going to come over there and just take over. Yeah. We're going to shut it down that night, y'all. We're going to have a party that night. We gonna, no laundry that night. Tonight, we going we yeah. to party that night. Yeah. So, we're going to get with you all and book this. Because we want the community to come out and be a Absolutely. part of the talk show uh-huh. and, and everything. And uh and just do it up that night. I know so that's we, nice. we're going to have a good time that night. We're going to yeah, have to do it. Not on Saturday night. We're going to do this. We're going to have to get with y'all so we yeah, can have definitely. a good time. We'll schedule. Yeah, definitely schedule it. We'll yeah. send it out to the community. Yeah, let them come out. And, yeah. we, and they'll love that. Yeah, and we can TV. take pictures and everything. Oh, yeah. And, yeah. and that will be business for all of us. Oh, so absolutely. people can come exactly. out and, and be a part of it. When my son started his business, you know, he he, he goes out, but the COVID stopped, you know, a lot right. of the stuff. Mm-hmm. But uh, we can book it for next year already. So, oh, yeah. Uh, God is good. So all we can all time. help each other. Yes. You know, with that's it. What it's the, about. That's what it's about. That's what it's about. Uh, uh, God said, get those that are unknown to become known. See, you all were unknown to the Talk of Life talk show. Yeah. Now you so are I known to it. all the people that are going to be watching this and they're going to say gosh i can go drop off my clothes you don't even have to drop them off y'all they will pick it up for you that is awesome they will pick it up for you and wash it even your underwear now that's the part that that's awesome Y'all are good. They clean your dirty drawers. <laughs> they clean your dirty drawers and make them smell good. Four hours, yes. Real good. Four hours. Real good. Yeah, yeah. yeah make them smell draw. so good you'll wear them for a week and not want. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to the pandemic, these were developed. Let me see. Let me see what's that. for the dirty drawers. I see. I can't breathe. <laughs> I can't breathe. Look out, your drawers are dirty. They need to go to see in that laundry. Yeah. And they will make it where you can breathe. Yeah, you can breathe. <laughs> I love it. I love it. That I really awesome. do love it. You all are awesome. so exciting. And, and the families look so happy. And yeah. the kids yes. are there enjoying. Yes. Oh, yeah, definitely. And they was excited. Them. Even the ones that was at the apartment, they were so excited. Uh-huh. To do the, I mean, this is just so exciting. It's, it's I am just so, and uh, another good thing to you, I'm just going to read this. It says, CNS Laundry is clean and relaxing laundromat equipped with the state of the art washers yes, and dryers. dryers. Yes, they Also are. allow us to offer you various types of promotional discounts, okay? Mm-hmm. Such as free dry, weekly promotion, coupon, and birthday bonus. So tell us a little bit about that. So we have a uh, loyalty program okay. where oh, really? you get a card wow. and every time you come, you get a stamp. And after so many oh. uses, you get free washes. Get out of here. So, and it's, oh, it's nice. just to Isn't give back. Nice? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Because oh, awesome. ultimately you can go anywhere. And so the fact that you choose to come to us, we yes. do appreciate that. Mm-hmm. That's oh, nice. So I'll get a card and every time I, wait a minute, can I get a stamp if I just come by there? I know. <laughs> you know what? We're going to have to start. We're going to have to. Y'all got to do something like that. The wheels are turning. That's a good idea. The wheels are turning. Make yeah. the card. So every time somebody comes to you, you can give them a free daiquiri. That's, that's a hey, idea. that'll work. That's a great idea. Yeah. See? See how God works? See? I'm yeah. telling you. That would be awesome. Yeah, I, I like do. that. The larger program. Yeah. Uh-huh. So they did. Uh-huh. How many times do you have to come before they get a free um, dry? Five times. Five. No, five times to get a free wash. Wash. Yeah, really? that's right. You get a free wash. Oh, that uh-huh. is awesome. Mm-hmm. Just yeah. like wow. if you went to yeah. anywhere mm-hmm. and you go after so many visits, they'll, right. give, you, they'll right. give you a free French fry. Right. <laughs> but we give a whole wash, you know. <laughs> so they get a whole free you wash. You get a free wash okay. up to a certain amount. Oh, but it's wow. um, every time. And it doesn't, if when you're finished with that card, you get another card. That's good. Wow. So what is the free dry? Is that you get the, is um, the dry free or free just? Free dry is um, for, for two months okay. at that time. We had um, no matter what, when you came in, it was free dry, was free dry. for two months. When okay. you finish washing, uh-huh. the dryers were free for you. Wow. Wow. So we have different programs, that different promotions awesome. all the time. That's nice. So y'all do different weekly promotions? Oh, we do different uh, like every other month. Okay, you'll change, change it up. up. Uh-huh. Oh, that is so exciting. So you got cute. Oh, what is the birthday bonus? Because I love birthdays. Uh, birthday bonus 
kind of varies. Okay. Yeah, birthday bonuses, you know, we identify, have a customer come put on the wall, let us know when their birthdays okay. are and when their birthday rolls back around. You know, we'll have something nice for them. Aww. Either there's a basket of laundry detergent items. Oh, that is exciting. Or a free wash or something like that. So, again, we appreciate all of our customers that come. That's right. Customer that's appreciation. Good. Yeah. Y'all are awesome. That's awesome. I mean, this this will make somebody want to come to your laundromat. <laughs> we hope so. I know it. God, yeah. I'm really they promoting this. We're going we're gonna to promote this uh, laundromat because... It, it makes you feel like you just walk into your own home and you can relax. Now, look, I might want to just bring my house because y'all got a sofa over there. I know, right? Well, it was conversation. <laughs> but we know a lot of times you bring in items like this. They're going to want to stay. They're going to want to stay. But those red <laughs> chairs are nice. The red chairs are nice. Oh, now they got yeah. red chairs too, yeah. Kimberly. Yeah, they're nice. Oh, wow. Y'all are <laughs> really nice. making yes. this nice. So they're when you nice. walk into your laundromat, what does it smell like? Um... Clean, fresh, like for instance, when you, you when you smell like bleach uh, and fabuloso, yes, Tide. Yes. 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 Um, yes, I yes, gain that that yeah. that, wow, that, 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 that fresh clean, smell. fresh yes. smell yes. when you put fresh. fabric Ooh, in. Yes. Yes. you have I'm that not, smell. I'm just imagine this. I love that, and it's really oh, bright. It's really bright. Nice. It's really yeah. bright. Yeah. The parking lot is bright. Yes. yes. Um, it's clean. The parking Good. lot is always clean. That's it's a awesome. bright parking lot. It's so uh, people very feel safe. safe when they yeah, come to your very uh, safe. Mm -hmm. to your laundromat and everything. Do y'all have security over there or? Is Actually, the police safe? department is directly across the street. Oh, right so where you the got good security is. then. Yeah, the Potter's House has a. Um, That's right. They sure do have that. there. Yeah, you're uh -huh. right. They sure do. And we we're very yeah, and mm -hmm. it's which we're um, you know have security at our place, but. We also have relationship with the Fort Worth Police Department, awesome. and so they ride through. They will come through. They've actually helped us on um, our feed the kids. Oh, um, that's um, nice. NPO. Yeah, NPO. Um, he Officer actually McNeil. came over. Officer McNeil. He would come over and help serve with the kids. And, oh, that and is stuff. nice. Because it's it's definitely like we're really really big on um, the community. I can tell. I see. I was looking at your website today. That is so nice, especially when you're giving back to the community. Mm -hmm. And then it happened with the kids. That's even so. When you giving out these books, are these like the library books? I mean, you know, they're um, well. When I what I started, I had started going to like different resale places mm -hmm. and just getting books. So whatever I could find, and then some friends as well have dropped books off. I have some uh, school teacher friends, and they've yes. brought books, okay. um, all different type, and they love it. And actually, with the the children when they read mm -hmm. when they come back and tell us about the book oh no you get a little incentive oh, for telling that us is about so the book awesome. yes. i'm gonna go through my little library at home and see because i still have Please some little do. books that uh when Emmanuel now was little i still have those little books and, so and they're picky through they pick the room they're yeah. like <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they nah, i, I still got my green eggs and ham i'll take my yeah, yeah, they no, they, see, they like those they, they like those they like the green eggs and ham he's just got no preaching on he loves his green eggs and ham baby do you still remember my green eggs and ham book i said that was the kids book i want to use it for a sermon i said okay so I don't think you're gonna get rid of green eggs and ham, <laughs> yeah. but I still have some more children books over there. Oh, this is so nice! So y'all give our uh, promotions and good stuff like that. We want you all to come to C and S Laundry. Do y'all remember the address, Kimberly? Uh, I just remember Dakri's. Okay, she just remembered that. <laughs> so since they that. don't remember the address, <laughs> I'm going to tell you all the address is one zero zero one. 1001 Woodhaven Boulevard, Sweet B, Fort Worth, Texas. And if you get a little lost, it's right up there. You'll see the part of the You see Channel 11. It's over that little area in there. Just Woodhaven, go down and you'll right. find it. It's, we're going to go over there because we're going to have us a nice little get together over there with the CNS Laundry. Okay, so let's look at something else I was going to read. <laughs> I'm <gonna> research. <laughs> okay, it says combined with our mega size washing and dryer. The biggest in town, we guarantee that you will save time and money. So yes. again, tell us how we're going to save time and money. I can say that by saying uh, they're efficient. Okay. And we have them set at a time slot that will get you in at least by 23 minutes okay. to wash. 
and it'll take you at least about wow. depend upon your size clothes okay because in nowadays the machines based time off weight so oh, it depends really? upon how much it weighs uh -huh. depend upon how fast the machines get ready wow i didn't know that so if you you know our washers can top out anywhere at 28 minutes depending okay. upon the size, the size of so you're looking at 30 minutes of washing okay maybe about 20 minutes of drying an hour you're out the door less than an hour or they can just have you out to pick it up right okay i want to stress that they'll pick up your clothes all your clothes all towels that. everything underwear garments everything comforters is there anything else Anything, anything that can anything be washable. Yeah. Pillows. Pillows. We got the pillows too. Rugs. Wow. Rugs and everything. Rugs and yeah. everything. Because you know rugs at home. Yeah. You just don't like to put your rugs what in about your the, What about the toilets? Right. I mean, you know, the, all of that. the seating and all that too. Oh, all that. Oh, y'all. What's your largest long? capacity? What's your largest um The largest, largest machine we commercial. have is, uh, it goes up to eight pounds. Eight pounds. Seven. Yeah. So oh. is it like. Sometimes they have little baskets where you can put seven. Yes, yeah, so you go well, got eight, eight pounds. baskets on. Eight? Yeah, eight baskets. Okay. Yeah. Wow. So it's eight loads. Yeah. So how many different size yes. machines do you have? You know, From uh, two load up two to load. eight load. Okay. Like the two okay. load is a small, you know, yeah, small, the real small one. size. Mm -hmm. All the way up to eight loads. Mm -hmm. And you have a total of how many dryers? There's a total of 19 dryer stackables. Sta yes, okay. so stackables. So you got one on top of one on top. Yeah, yeah. And how many washing machines total, no matter what size? Uh, 35. 36, 37. That's good. That is That's good. good. That's mm -hmm. awesome. Did you see the wash and dryer? They look really nice. I know they it. do. They look they really, really nice. Do. They look like you're walking into a big old Yeah, room. fancy, really <laughs> I fancy tell you. place. So <laughs> this CNS, remember, is C and S laundry, okay? And I am so happy to have y'all on. The, yes. And the really the good thing is you can sit there, relax. They have a big screen TV. And you know, y'all go there, get your daiquiri, wash your clothes, your daiquiri, or just oh. go there and get your daiquiri and sit there. And and uh, you're not getting it free now. You got to pay for the daiquiri. <laughs> and you got to act with the sense. Point. They don't have no foolishness there. Because they are, are, hey, top-notch laundromat. And they the restrooms are beautiful. Yes. They five are star. beautiful. Our five facility star. is fully attended at all times. That's good. So if anything happens, you're going to have a attendant there that will help you. Right. Uh, it, it, they get money changed up to $20, you said. Uh -huh. So they can do dollars, $5, $10, and $20. Okay, so if you go in there and don't have any uh, change, you can get change there. Machine. But don't go in there trying to get the money to go play slot machines or whatever. <laughs> okay, no, yeah. it's only for the laundromat. <laughs> All right, so we want to make sure of that. And then she's, they got on here that they are well trained. So these people that are there are going to be well trained. In jujitsu. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm just kidding. Oh, they do karate too. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Well trained. Okay. <laughs> Well trained on how to wash, make sure that your clothes are washed and everything. Experience and their courteous. We have to have good customer service, service and their friendly yes. staff to assist you. Right. And that means everything. Because when you go into a place, you want to have good customer service. You want people to treat you nice and not rude. And Kimberly and I know that too as well because we work in the in the public as well. So we have to. That's me why Kim I always smile and smile Kim. <laughs> See, it's just trained, automatic. Yeah, yeah, it's automatic. That's all we do is smile and talk, smile and talk and direct. Okay, so our staff ensures that all the machines are in mint condition at all times. So you're not going to walk in there and you're going to see 10 uh, washes out of order. I, I hate when I go off. into a place yeah. and it says out of order. It ought to be in order. Mm -hmm. And, and, and the, yes. the, the thing too with what made us um, be able to last this long mm -hmm. is that he had to learn how to fix the machines. Yeah, you that can't saves afford, money. You cannot afford when you're just starting out. Yes hiring someone to come and now get your expensive. machines they're very very very, very expensive. expensive that's true and so if you don't um if you're a small 
Mm -hmm. like we are you know a lot of people go into it with investors we don't have that okay. so right, we have to man. learn how to do done. everything mm -hmm. awesome. and so being able to fix the machines that or at good. least being able to diagnose so yes. even if you have to have a tech come yeah you can tell them exactly that what it is, is as opposed to that's you know awesome. so that's that good. that was a, a main staple in the business being successful and that's good mm -hmm. that's right, awesome Sam. To be, uh, yeah, Sanford. <laughs> he got it from Sanford and Son. Yeah. <laughs> Picking up John Yeah, you know how he did on Sanford and Son. He made it work. Piece it together. <laughs> but see, with our minds, we can do anything. There you go. Go get it up and do it. Well, just to, just to add to that, we also, uh, <laughs> <look at it. laughs> we, we also take credit cards and we also do really? we do atm so if you come in and you don't have wow. cash you can use your card for it to get cash so look I at this y'all are just See keep there. on talking so we're gonna find out some more about this they do atm cards and credit cards mm -hmm. and uh, to services. get to get the money out in case you say Correct. i forgot my money Correct. So you know how some people walk in, they say, oh, I forgot my money. Can y'all loan me some money to wash my clothes? Yeah. That don't work. Uh-uh. That uh -huh. don't work, y'all. So it's a what you need? What you need? <laughs> OK, so if you forget your purse and you walk out, because sometimes we do that. We'll uh -huh. forget our purse. But even if you forget the purse, ain't, ain't no way to them car. So you got to go back home, baby. Yeah. I'm sorry. You no, got to go back home. But or you can leave that. the clothes. Can they leave it and pay yeah. later? But we have had instances yeah. where Especially regular customers that come oh, in, mm -hmm. if you will put it in there and they bring the money back. See, or something. I good. mean, that's just because yeah. we are, you know, them like we're too. in the community. Yes. It's, it's we're three years deep, okay. and so a lot of the people, we know who they are. Okay. We know their families. We know their children. And you know where they live. Yeah, we know where they. <laughs> and we will come find you. And we are here. Yeah. Yeah. They know yeah. where you yeah. live. And plus, you're not gonna get your clothes <laughs> back until you pay for them. That's, that's, that's it, that's right? right okay. There. Oh, you see, Sam, he, he was looking double when I said that he gave me that. Yeah. So, you know, that's it, Sam. So, hey, you can drop your clothes off, but you will not get your clothes until you pay me. Okay? That part. That is good. I love, I, what another thing I love, I love y'all personality. Yeah. I love yeah. your personality because that what really helps people. You know, a lot of times you got, you have those businesses and they go under. When you talk to the people, it's customer service. Mm -hmm. They have mm -hmm. bad ratings. You know, and when you get people to say, oh, I want them to do this. I want them to do that. You know, even like my son with his business, they will call and they, they'll tell them, man, can you bring your mom back? I'm just going <laughs> to give a pat out on me tonight. Yeah. And he be said, yeah, I bring my mom. What about the other, your auntie? That's but that's the other coast. I know. Can you bring her back? And I'll be there. Yeah, I said, so you see, Emmanuel, you need us. You know, <laughs> you can't fire your mom. Okay? Yeah, yeah. You know, no, we, we, we get out there, we have fun, we mingle with the people. Uh -huh. And that was builds your business. Yeah, exactly. Uh -huh. exactly. You got yeah. to be able to mingle. So we have they, whole conversations yes. at the laundromat. And people, you know, a lot of times people like to see the owner. Uh -huh. they, do. they do. It makes them feel good to see the owner walks in. And it makes you feel good when you can say you the owner. Mm -hmm. Doesn't it? Doesn't it make you feel good when you? I mean, when you think I'm about an employee. It. I'm an employee. No, that's it. <laughs> but y'all an employee, but you still the owner. But you know the way I look at it. What, what you they, tell if me? They're there. People want to take care of their stuff better. Yeah, because if they're right, there they and they see that y'all care about them, yeah. they're mm -hmm. going to care about your that's employees, what, and that's they're going to care about. It. They're not gonna just that's a great point. Out. That uh -huh. is, and most people will tear up your stuff if they see that even though y'all are employees, you still owners, right? Uh huh. Okay, but I like that y'all said y'all the employees too. That's good. So the owner and the employee are together. <laughs> yes. yes. That's good. We're not, hung, we're not hung up on the title. Right. We're so you walk like, in, look, I'm the owner of this place. <laughs> so we don't have to see that. They won't know who the owners are. No. And that's good because sometimes it's not good to know who the owners are. Because yeah, uh -huh. they might come in there, bam, bam. <laughs> We don't want nothing to happen to the home. But that's good. But I'm talking to, but some people feel really good when they can come in and say, I know them. I didn't do it. And when they're uh -huh. talking to their friends, they say, Well, yeah. I know, I know CNS. I know, I know them. Yes. Uh -huh. I know yes. Them. See, that's what we can say now, y'all. Sit there, give me. We can say, hey, we I know, know the no. we are family now. <laughs> we are okay, yeah. we, we family, family yeah. now. We family. Everybody that come on the Talk of Life Talk show, you all, we are family. And this is one of my visions as well. Mm -hmm. And I mentioned it to the co-host that when we get over this COVID stuff, we're going to throw a big party right. mm -hmm. and we're going to bring back and invite everybody. That's going to be so many people because Kim just keep going out there. <laughs> 
Woo! And we're gonna have a big party, and that's what we're gonna throw a nice big party and bring everybody back. And wow. just, just that's that's one of the visions that I want to do because without you all, we wouldn't have a good show. Because well, we would still have a good show anyway. Because we are what sister chat, you know. So we would still have a good show. But the show is always good when we can bring. Uh, other guests on from the community yes and from the community and, and on not the only that they are business owners and yes. we can network mm -hmm. so we're going to bring that vision in too uh so everybody that comes in to this uh i haven't gotten a name yet for it they're all network and we're going to have you know maybe we get whatever what's the, what's the catering name we can bring people Eddie in Jones. and cater uh -huh. and set up everything because we've had doctors on the show and uh mm -hmm. I mean, I'm sure. I mean, we. I mean, it's just so nice. I met so many people. Haven't we, y'all? Yeah. We met so oh, yeah. many beautiful people. people. Beautiful. And people. now we can add CNS Laundry to our uh, repertoire, and, and we're going hire you. Y'all are going somewhere. You're gonna inspire I, I, people. I'm gonna take take. We're gonna we, we're gonna take it to another level. <laughs> yeah. So let me ask you, how long have you been? How long have you had your talk show? I've had my talk show. I'll say a good uh, almost 15. I'm gonna say 20 years, really, because. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, I did it in this just little bit pieces, and then we got to the point where we started just doing it, uh, just talking in the church, and, and then going to different little things. And then uh, about, I'll say about maybe four or five years ago, we started uh, going, trying to bring it up. And then when my son graduated from uh, his the video school, mm -hmm. he said, Mom, let's take it to another level. <laughs> and so if you go back and uh, I try to do a throwback Thursday where you can see what we just had just we really now. The first begun. Now uh, we Facebook Got Live yeah. and YouTube and you Live where you can go back and see some of our old shows and see how we, you know, mm -hmm. grown. Yeah, yeah, I'm just watching a show where you had the Dr. Jorge. Yes. And his daughter? Yes. Yes. Kimberly brought her. Oh, yes. You know them? Those are my buddies. No, uh, oh, I was watching the show and uh you asked me, you said, Do you do you drink while you're on the pulpit? <laughs> I'm crazy on this show. <laughs> Oh, but we have so much because people think Christians can't have fun. Mm -hmm. right. And I love having fun, you know, because I meet people and you get to the point where you are so holy, then now you run people away. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And, and Christ was able to talk to everybody. He right. did parables right. and, and he drew people in. And, and when God gave me this show, it, it was a, it's a show of love. It's a show of uh, being able to just mingle with everybody. Mm -hmm. Right. And the good part, you don't even have to be a Christian to be on the show. And people are like, what? It's a Christian-based show. But no, you don't have to be a Christian, but you're not going to change our faith, you know. Right. You, right. Uh, you know, so we we entertain everything. Our theme is is to get to know you, get your business out there, hear your testimony, uh, how you got there. How you got started. Yeah, how you got started and how God bless you with this because without yeah. him, I, I just can't Let see it. I, I just can't now, see it. Now, my other question, if you don't mind me asking, now, do y'all have families apart? Are y'all just single? Or you have husband, wives, families, children? Yeah, we're we're only partners via the business. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have two separate lives outside of that. Mm -hmm. So we manage our home lives mm -hmm. as well as businesses and work and mm -hmm. family and all of that so that, yeah it's two separate entities <laughs> oh good good okay now that i was saying you guys were married or anything i just didn't yeah. know if maybe because you know some people are single and don't have kids right and, and my son business. is um actually a, a junior he graduates in december from houston baptist university all right yeah, yeah. 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 All right. <laughs> So how many children do you Boy have? Miller, number five, with Houston Baptist cornerback, best cornerback in Texas. Yeah. All right, a yeah. football player. He's a football player. Yeah. You think he going uh -huh. to? Well, we're gonna say he going to the NFL. He is. He's the best cornerback. All right, right. then. Hey, <laughs> yeah, what's his name again? Coy Miller. All right, <laughs> Mister Miller. <and> Al. <laughs> hey, we gotta get him to the Cowboys. That's my team. I'm yeah, sorry, so That's, but if I'm he gets to the NFL, I'll be with whoever team he's on. Yeah. Yes, we got one of our members. I forgot. Uh, I forgot what team my son was with. Oh, but anyway, we have got a shout out. But anyway, uh, but I'm just a cowboy fan, you know. But none of us is. She's a Raiders fan. But we don't talk about the Raiders on the show, okay? But we wish him well. Good. Thank so you yes. only have one child. I only have one. one. How uh -huh. many you have? I have two boys. Okay, then uh, one's thirty and twenty-eight. 
Are you serious? You look so young. I need to see your driver's license. I know where your birth certificate is. That is awesome. So, uh, okay, then it says here before we get ready to close. Oh, I didn't know. The time is almost up. Okay, so uh, they have uh, free Wi-Fi outlets for mobile devices and laptops. So you all have it all going on there. Gosh. It's a one-stop shop. It's a one-stop shop. Our time is up and uh this hour has just really gone by really it fast really and uh we have just really enjoyed you all and remember Thank just you. before we close, what could you all say to our audience to get them to see in this laundry? Sanford, would you like to take that? Uh just know that uh we're here uh we're a black owned business. We support our community. We love to have you come out and visit us. Uh, we, we definitely appreciate all of our members and, and customers that come out and see us. Uh, come check us out. Uh, we won't, we won't let you down. And they're located again at 1001 Woodhaven Boulevard, Sweet B, Fort Worth, Texas, 76112. And uh, do you want the phone number out? Or? Absolutely. The phone number, is it the 469 yes, number? Yes, right? Phone number 469-565-6861. And we're going to have this information at the bottom of the screen as well so that you all will know how to get in touch with CNS Laundry. Uh, again, the owners are Corbett and Sanford. Yes. And we're so happy they're black owned. You can get daiquiris there, free delivery pickup, laundry hours again, Monday through Friday. What time? 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. And Saturday and Sunday? 7 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay, do you host y'all have anything else to say before we close out? I just, y'all make sure y'all have my worms when I call. <laughs> and she want her worms. I <laughs> worms. She want her worms on the deck and everything. It is an honor to meet them. I know it's an honor to meet y'all. Yeah. I'm excited. I'm Yes, and we're company. going to have a good time. Right, girls? When yes. we take yes. the show. Yes. To see you next night, we're going to book a date and we're going to go out there and we're going to so take the Talk of Life Talk Show with Elma to CNS Laundry located at 1001 Woodhaven Boulevard, Sweet B, Fort Worth, Texas, 76112. Again, thank you, Cabet, and thank you, Sanford, thank for you. being on the Talk of Life Talk Show with Cynthia, Tavana, and Kimberly tonight. Again, watch our show Facebook and YouTube with the Talk of Life Talk Show with Elma every Monday at 8 p.m. Live, have fun, go by CNS Laundry. Until we see you face to face, if you would like to be on the Talk of Life talk show, check us out at elmatalkshow.com. And don't forget to watch us on Mondays, 8 p.m., Facebook and YouTube. Love you. <laughs>